with y'all. It's your boy Ross back at it again with another video. So I want to say earlier today as of me filming, I was planning on dropping a video basically talking about me not being excited for Survivor Series this year. And before I even got home to edit the video, you guys were hitting me up in the DMs saying Xavier Woods, King Woods himself has come up with a brand new idea for Survivor Series that I thought was very interesting and I had to make a, another video uh, to talk about it. So it's funny that this happened, the timing that it did, because I was really about to drop a video proclaiming my, I guess you can say, I guess me not being as excited for Survivor Series this year because I felt like it was just kind of a, a bland card how they set up the men's Survivor Series uh, uh, competitors were just kind of bland and just random. No one had to really fight to, you know, be a part of the men's team on Raw and SmackDown. It just kind of booked itself but seemed kind of bland to me. I wasn't really as interested as I thought I, was, I would be. But King Woods has come up with a very cool idea. There's a clip on on uh youtube on the wwe page of him skating around in a, a wooded area or whatnot he's addressing roman and the usos which i like and um i'm interested to see how that plays out uh on smackdown this week but he also came up with a great idea basically whoever wins on the on on each brand will be fighting for spots at uh this uh next year's royal rumble so the winning team will be fighting for spots 25 through 30 and the losing team will be fighting for spots one through five and i think that is dope i think it gives the survivor series match that much more importance because now whichever brand wins they will be vying pretty much going against each other or have the opportunity to be 25 to 30 which is a good spot to come in at the royal rumble and whoever team loses they are pretty much going to be one of the first five spots and you don't really want that in the royal rumble so it gives incentive for each brand to win that particular men's uh survivor series elimination match because now there's future title implications involved and i love this that is very ingenious that's actually pretty cool and i hope they go through with it because now it gives the survivor series some importance because before it was just brand supremacy but we all know at smackdown is the better brand you know in my opinion granted i heard uh raw is getting a little bit better but as a viewership still i think smackdown is the better brand but it doesn't really lend to anything it's just like all right we just had a one-off match against each other now all right cool we go back to our regular schedule program but now there's some importance to it is now okay man we got to make sure we win this because i'm trying to have the the last few spots in the royal rumble 25 through 30 is a good good number to go through instead of being the first through fifth spot in the royal rumble that was dope so that actually gave me some intrigue to this year's survivor series and it's like i said it's funny because i legitimately was not about to make this video talking about me being hyped for Survivor Series. It was going to be my disappointment in the buildup and how I didn't really too much care about the pay-per-view. But now, I, I definitely do care about it. And I'm interested to see what they do with Xavier Woods here. How they build up between Big E and Roman. Because you know, it's going to be title versus title. Champion versus champion. So you know that's going to you know happen. But it's going to tie in what happens with xavier woods here but ultimately this is dope this is very dope gives some type of life to this pay-per-view because it needed it outside of just the champions versus champions you know what i'm saying and in the women's survivor series match and the men's survivor series match it's one of those things where it's like now it gives some some type of some type of freshness to it and i think they could potentially keep this going in years you know years to come because now survivor series is you know it makes sense to want your want your brand to win want your team to win because now you could potentially be winning the royal rumble and i'm pretty sure they'll probably do it for the, the women's royal rumble because that also gives implications as well and it makes even more sense because now you can do some long-term booking potentially you can have some 
future individuals that could potentially win the Royal Rumble, building them up from Survivor Series. I think that's great. WWE definitely needs to do some long-term booking here. And I like the fact that Xavier Woods, aka King Woods himself, came up with it. So I hope this is a sign of things to come for Xavier. I, I definitely hope they don't waste this because that's a pretty cool idea for him to come up with. Um, and I hope they run with it because you know how WWE is. If somebody comes up with the idea, they tend to not run with it because they didn't come up with it. And I think this would be awesome and interesting. So comment down below. Does this increase your hype your, for Survivor Series now, now knowing potentially if they go with this, potentially what implications could come from the winning teams of the Survivor Series matches? Or is it still kind of the same, like you're not really too interested or you don't really care at all? So comment down below. Let me know. It's just a real quick video. I definitely will be uploading some more videos for you guys this weekend so uh just wanted to let you guys know that um looking forward to dropping some more content for you guys we're almost at 60k thank you guys so much for all the love and support thanks to everyone that be joining in on the streams i will be doing some more streaming uh sometimes next week uh p potentially this weekend we will see i know we got the aw stream uh i'm not sure if we're going to be able to do it uh, depending on a uh, dub schedule but we will try to do that if if we don't end up doing it together then i may end up doing it solo depending on their schedule or whatnot but we will at some point it will be on the main channel where we'll be re reacting to aew or it'll be on this channel where we'll be checking out the pay-per-view since it is this saturday so thank you guys so much appreciate all love and support road to 60k appreciate y'all kicking with me i'll see y'all on the next one Peace.